Hey, good evening, everyone. Welcome back to Xenonauts. So, we are... We have to capture an alien alive for interrogation. Um, which I think means we need... To give... Do we have the baton? Ah, I clicked on the wrong thing. Um... We don't have the baton yet. Okay, so we need the stun baton. There are other ways to knock aliens unconscious, but they are... Not particularly viable in a lot of situations, and we don't have the uh, stun grenades yet, so that's not going to work either. Um, alien plasma rifle, great. Done researching that. Okay, um, yeah, that all sounds good. Alright, start of the month. Funding... Zero continents lost. Alright, so we got a bunch of money, which means that we can start working on another base. Um, it seems like there's a lot of activity around North and South America, so we're going to throw our new base in... Uh, what is that? Is that 80? I'm struggling to remember where all of the, uh, where all of those islands are. I know that's Cuba. Ah, oh, whatever. It doesn't matter. Um, actually, do I want that base there? It gives us a nice point to launch interceptors from. Yeah, that actually gives us decent, you know, once we get it upgraded and stuff, that gives us decent radar coverage. Yeah, all right. Put this here. So that's going to be under construction for a little bit. Um, other than that, we're mostly waiting for more UFOs to show up and waiting for our armor to be done. Ooh, stun batons. Great. Okay. So now that that's done, um, grab me the scout car. I'll probably... Once we get an upgraded dropship, I might get a uh, get a scout car as backup. Because um, right now we have eight people in the dropship, and the dropship holds eight people. Um, and I don't really want to decrease our team size any at this point. Um, but if we have more room on the dropship, I might consider adding a, uh, adding a scout car to it for some extra fire support. Um, otherwise, I want people carrying stun batons. How much does a stun baton weigh? Okay, not all that much. Alright, so you can ditch one of your smoke grenades there. Uh, and then we're going to call this the default for you. Uh, you can actually just add one of these in. Um, okay, hang on. Let me let me fix these up real quick. Okay, everyone's carrying a stun baton now, and we've got a few more people with jackal armor. Great. All right, what do we got? Fast one. You are going to need a fox trot. I think a single fox trot should be able to take you down, and you're going to need a condor. Until over land. There we go. Alright, let's see how this plays out. I don't think these can barrel roll, so we should just be able to uh, let's keep this just in case. Good. Alright, so those can't barrel roll. That's good to know. Um, we should just be able to send our troops right up. Let me just make sure that we didn't pick up an extra set of jackal armor. No, we haven't got that done yet. We're so close to having them done. Three days until we have all of the jackal armor that we could want. Um, alright, I'm going to let this tick over just a little bit longer because I'm worried about getting a night mission, but let's get going, boys. Tail that until it's over land. Gauge that. Nice. Wow, we didn't even take any damage. 
All right, so depending how well this uh, regular scout mission goes, we might be able to send Charlie down to that other crash site. Although, I don't think they're going to make that before nightfall. We might just airstrike that one. Okay. Uh, oh. You guys are all... Oh, no, you're in the right spots. That's right, you just don't have Jack Lummer. Okay. This is probably a bigger map. We are in the back corner, so that's good. Yeah, this is a larger map. All right, everybody fan out. Give me some uh, line of sight on stuff. Okay, let's see. We've got this building here, which is probably a good place to get our sniper set up, actually. So I'm going to have uh, Taylor start heading over there. Everybody else split up, find some cover. Um, where do I want you? That's a good question. Somewhere where you're less exposed, I guess, over here will work. And then... There we go. Everybody crouch. Then Green can go over here, where he's got cover on all sides. And we'll bring Brown with him. Okay, I have my doubts that there's anything over here. I mean, they could have spawned in there, but I'm guessing that spot is, like, blocked off. We'll go check it out anyways. Okay, so we're fighting civilians. That's good to know. And it sounds like a farmer just shot one. Okay, that's good. And we've got this hedgerow here. Okay, why don't you just go make sure the back of that building is... Can I see the square? Okay, good. Alright, so far so good. Let's uh, scoot you along to here. Bring Lingren with you. I'm going to split Taylor off by himself. He's going to go get set up up there. For the time being, until we... Uh... Alright, he can't go any further. Um... Until we have a better idea of where all of the enemies are. Oh, there's one running through that field there. Good to know. Alright, Taylor, just run. Uh, actually, you can get up here. Civilians have crappy eyesight. And then you can shoot... Oh, you can't shoot out those windows. Damn, I thought those would be... Oh, you actually can't... Ah, oh, you can't get up to the top in this building. Damn. Okay. That means the only two windows I can actually set up at are directly overlooking our own landing site. Well, that's awkward. Alright. That's a shame. Um, so we know there's a dude over here. So let's go ahead and... Hmm. How best to approach this. I'm still wary of this area over here. Have you... Yeah, see, that looks like an opening to me. It's hard to tell what's an opening and what's just, like, the, the map not rendering yet. Um, have you guys sit here. Just kind of cover this door for me. Make sure that anyone who uh, runs out there has some second thoughts about going any further. Okay, there's our ship. Um... This is awfully exposed. Okay, I'm gonna have you run nowhere. You actually can't get here. Alright, just go stand in this corner for a second. While we uh, bring everybody else up to give some better cover. Okay, I guess that'll have to do for now. Okay, there's one of our boys. 
this ship, we might actually be able to uh, rock it open if I'm feeling particularly malicious. Okay, so there's someone over there, right? I know that, because we saw him. So I'm going to have you guys wait here while these guys go check along the back. See if there's actually a hole over there that we can use to get around behind him. Yeah, there is. All right, perfect. Uh, in the meantime, maybe you guys come up here, take a peek. Okay, this looks all blocked off over here, apart from that one black space over there. That's clear. Cool. There he is. Okay, so he's back there. Do I throw a grenade at him? Yeah, probably not worth it. So have you guys come out along here. So he's he's far away, right? We know that. He's not gonna be able to run this whole distance and then uh, shoot someone. I hope. This is the back corner. Great. All right. As for you guys, um, let's just make sure that this is all safe over here. Not loving these uh, dense wood lines, but this that's all blocked off. Let's run up to it to make sure there's nobody lurking behind it, but I suspect that's all inaccessible. Okay, and that's safe. All right, Popova. Uh, oh, you don't have a rifle. That's right. You don't have enough, you don't have the capacity to bring a rifle. Okay, you guys can just settle in here. Keep an eye on that door for me. I like the hay bales like torn in half like that. That's cool. It's a neat little uh, detail. Okay. Oh. Okay, so he's like right around this corner here. Can you see him? Excellent. Classic. Alright, uh, I'm gonna bring you over here, just to cover him. Make sure that nothing else nasty sneaks up on us. The benefit of fighting the civilians is that they tend to move close in to engage. So I can get away with being a little bit more exposed than I would against seasons who will shoot you from really far away. I might just have the rest of you guys double back at this point, um, and we can secure the ship and then worry about uh, sorting everyone else out later. Hi. Because this all looks fairly safe over here. Alright, so if I'm bringing you guys back, is there a gap in that hedge? No, there's not. Alright. running down this way. Taylor can watch the back here, just in case. And everybody else can run. Eh, I don't like that route. Go this way. Okay, there's no real cover on the edge of the ship here, annoyingly have you guys continue scouting around. Just in case. Hi. It's just taking a peek. Oh, this is accessible. Neat. It's probably not worth checking, though. Yeah, if there's any aliens back there, then whatever. Have you guys start? Can you make it over here in one go? No, you cannot. All right, let's get you 
here. And then next turn you can run from there around to the other side of the ship. So this one's actually big enough that we can use explosives to open the front door without uh, destroying everything inside, which is good. Whether I'm going to end up doing that or not kind of depends on how things look when I open the door, really. Hi. Okay, good. Let's uh, skip across real quick. Oh, hello. That's awkward. Um, hmm. You are in a rough spot now. Where can I get you that's covered? So the problem is now that he knows that she's here. This guy can open the door and shoot her in the back. We're going to do this, we're going to crouch, and we're going to trust to our jackal armor um, for just a moment here. I'm going to have you duck up here, alright, because so we have to resolve this issue first. Uh, can you guys get around the back of the ship? Actually, I'm just going to have you, just in case he decides to uh, come outside, we'll have people ready for him. Everybody's so clustered up over here. Do you have a shot on this guy? No, not at all. Okay, that's fine. Shield took a hit. That's okay. Oh, I actually can't hit you from here. I can hit you from here, though. Nope, I can't hit you from here. This is awkward. Amazing. Okay. Mm. I'm trying to see if I can suppress him. What we might have to do is... Oh, you're not going to be able to run over there and throw a grenade, are you? Yeesh. Alright, dealing with this guy is uh, getting messy. Okay, let's have you run here. You can crouch there, and I'm going to start swinging the support team into a better position to shoot into the doorway. Actually, this guy's in a perfect spot for us to uh, stun the him to death, now that I think about it. So we might do that next turn. And Watson... Let's get that door open so we don't have to worry about that dude uh, popping out behind us, huh? Ah! Oh. Damn it! I knew that was gonna happen. Oof! All right, this is uh, yeah. Can you see him? Shoot at him, anyways. Okay, he's suppressed. Um, I need to stop her from bleeding to death first. Drop this. Good. And then... Uh, this may not work, and if he just shoots Popova, she's just going to straight up die, which is unfortunate. Um, on the other hand, this is a problem that we can now solve. Yeah, get out of here. And then bring Lindgren over. Do you have a shot on this guy? Absolutely not. Alright, we're just going to have to trust that suppression for the moment, unfortunately. 
Oh, there it is. Alright, this dude gets to be experimented on for all the trouble that he's caused me. That was absolutely not worth it. I, I should not have uh, crossed blindly over in front of the ship before I knew it was on the other side. <sighs> Lessons learned. Okay. So, we have some friends. Your rocket launcher. Uh, yeah, reload your rocket launcher. And then you can just put it back on your back for now. I don't think we're going to need it anymore. Now let's uh, start thinking about moving in here, huh? Oh, friends. Can you see him from there? Yeah, you can. Which means... If I crouch here and bring you up... this. Peg him in the face with it. Good. And duck back, and Tan can just add to his misery with a burst of rifle fire. Uh, let's see. If I bring... If I bring Lingren over here. Perfect. Okay, so... He does not have enough to use to crouch, but that's fine. Ah, he missed. Okay, that's all right. Oh my god. Suppressed civilian with the long shot. Okay. All right. It's, uh... Enough of this. Oh my god, he's alive. Uh... Hit chance. That leaves you awfully exposed. Oh my god, he's still alive! This is making me so sad. The civilians just causing me trouble. At least we got one of them alive. He's gonna shoot someone. Oh my god, we're taking so much damage. Alright, put him down, please. Oh my god. Please, guys. Can you move out of the way, actually? We're gonna we're gonna solve this problem. Thank you. Oh man, three people dead. Oh, that's, that sucks, man. All because I made that one, I, I moved too fast across the ship like that. And, oh, Tan's a captain. Well, that's good. All right, so who's dead? Popova. Um, Pollock. Oh, man, she's been here since the start. I guess all these guys have really been here since the start, or most of them have. Still. It's a shame. She was doing she was doing good, too. Uh, who else died? Lingren. Lingren's... Ugh. Lingren's honestly felt the worst. That was such a, a fucking, like, one in a million shot for a civilian to make. To just, like, one shot him from that far away. Oh, well. Alright. Well, we're definitely not doing that other mission now. We need to recruit some new people. Good. So now we can interrogate and analyze some peeps. Um, which we'll do... Get rid of that. Um, wait, what do I have you guys research? Oh, right, the scout car. Okay. Yeah, we can just wait until that 
finishes before we um, work on anything else. For the time being, we need to recruit. Okay, we need a new breacher to replace Popola. Oh, higher soldiers. Uh, so we want someone with good health, good bravery. Ooh. Yeah, you're pretty good. Alan Bell. Welcome to the team, Alan. Write down what role you're supposed to be in for when you get hired. Great. Alright, um, I'm going to hire you. We're going to need a shield as well. So I'd like someone with good bravery. Good reflexes, good strength. Yeah, that's a pretty good... That's a pretty good stat line right there. Your reflexes are terrible, I'm not hiring you. Alright. Solberg, you're gonna be our new shield. Okay, and then to replace our uh, our assistant from the other team. So, someone with good strength and good TUs. Wow, your accuracy is terrible. Uh oof, tough choice. Alright. Uh let's take. Matsui, actually. He's got pretty decent in everything apart from reflexes, which I don't really need him to have. Yeah, right. We're gonna take you. Alright. Hi, everyone. Um, casualty list. Yeah. Pollock had seven missions and four kills. Jeez. Oh, Lingren had six missions and five kills. Sad times. Alright, well, um, that seems like a decent place to call it for today, so thank you all so much for watching. I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.